am Danielle Robay with the Red Carpet Report, and we are in Hollywood at the Justice Ball, where celebrities are showing their support for the fight against human trafficking. Jessica, let's talk Playboy Radio. What's going yes. on? Lots of stuff is going on. Uh, you know, I'm doing with Bob Getty, who's going to be here tonight, so you're going to have to catch him and see what he has to say. But we're there every day, uh, Monday through Friday, 3 to 5, and now we're going to move it to a morning talk show, which I'm super stoked for, you know, kind of make it more towards, like, the Kelly Ripa Regis, you know, type of thing. I know it's Kelly Michael now, but... So we've been uh, making the transition. It's going really well. And uh, I think I found my soulmate when it comes to TV hosting is Bob. <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> because he's just, he, he's funny. I mean, you'll get it once you talk to him. He's a charmer. He really knows how to like just, I, you know, I've gone through a lot of co-hosts before and I've you know been hosting for the past 11 years and just having him and I, we just click. And I think like everything happens for a reason. And we're just, we're just kicking butt. Except for when you please see him, just mention that today's Wednesday because it's his favorite day. It's, it's hot had, all day. I was just going to oh. say. <laughs> please, please, just do it because, uh, yeah, he'll, he'll love you forever. <laughs> and what's your favorite part about being part of the Playboy family? You know, it, it's been, I've been there for almost 10 years. You know, I'm on, you know, Kendra's show, which is um, on Fridays on WeTV. Just started airing uh, two weeks ago. And, uh, you know, you're going to see a lot of stuff on there. She comes to Playboy Radio. You know, she's maybe going to get her own show. There's also an episode of me posting for Playboy, which is going to be out in November which was kind of nerve wracking. And uh, there's just so much opportunity in Playboy. And I think people get a little like, you know, scared thinking it's a, like one thing, but there is so many things that you can do, you know, with the Playboy brand. And I'm very happy to be a part of it. It's been 10 years and plus that just aged me. <laughs> yes, I just turned 30. Anyways, it's been fantastic. <laughs> and and you still employ me at 30. <laughs> And equal opportunity employers. Yes! So if you could go back and ask your 15-year-old self a question or give her a piece of advice, what would it be? Oh, my goodness. Um, take your clothes off from her money. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's horrible. My 15-year-old self, I was so different from the, from uh, where I'm at now. I mean, I was I was so shy. I was so, um, I didn't even kiss a boy. I was, I was so good. So I would tell myself to um, lay off the Jack Daniels. <laughs> And, uh, you know what, just keep on living. I actually, I really don't have any regrets. And, you know, I, I, don't, I, I don't think I would say much, to be honest. And I, I really can't. That's a good question. I'll let you think about that, but quickly, <laughs> hottest guy in Hollywood right now? Um, besides my hot husband, Kyle Carlson, I will have to say Jason Statham. I love him. I don't care. I love him. Transporter me all day. I love him. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Thank you. That's it for tonight. Thank you for watching. Click like, subscribe, comment, whatever you want. I gotta go party. See ya. Perfect. This is cute. Thank you. That's cute. Oh my God. Do you mind if I come in with you? Yes. Yes. Okay. It's so crowded in here. I know. Oh my God. What is this?